let's see and welcome back to some more Valheim. Right, now we have been quite busy uh, since last time. We did discover the swamp with four, maybe it was five, maybe six, I'm not sure if this is double, but yeah, at least uh, four dungeons. We got ourselves a full gear, fully geared up in, with iron, got all the extremities, extremities, whatever you call it. So now we are good to go. Now I did not craft a club, even though it has been highly recommended to me, but I created one for my wife, and she does have a high level bronze club, so that is probably what I'm gonna use against bone mass. And speaking of bone mass, we did find where is it now? Okay, so bone mass is supposedly over here. So we're gonna try to make our way towards him. And we will see. Perhaps we manage to get him today. Maybe. I mean, again, we're starting to get overgeared a little bit. But again, we we had some time. Now I do have one confession that we did make it a little bit easier for for ourselves. Now the first time we did, uh, well, we did travel all the way back. Probably would be faster with a boat, and then we could explore a little bit because usually you just. Uh, fill the boat up to the top with the stuff that you need since this doesn't matter the weight limit and then you can just drive home but we have let's see can I show it maybe here yeah there we go there's no portal sign on these things so yeah a little bit of cheating but again we are kind of just aiming for the new stuff we have done all of this before now we're going to turn it off once we get to the ashlands and probably some mistlands stuff too I think but for uh, for this episode, it is uh, stayed on. Just want to be honest. Yes. So right now we're just collecting stuff in order to make the bigger boat. Hopefully my wife has a little bit of deer hide. We will see. And she does. She has actually quite a few. Not bad. There we go. And then we just need a little bit more. Hmm. Has my wife collected? Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. That is the only reason why you should get a wife, because they are good at gathering. There we go, now we can make the bigger boat. And also we made this entire thing. Yeesh. Did some dungeons in order to just smelt everything. Oh yes, now hang on, I do need some turnips. Now also, since we did pay for the bill uh, for the cat, I splurged a little bit and I got myself a haircut. Well, it is my wife that usually does my hair, but I also have some in, in my family who's a professional hairdresser, so yes. But it's about time that I get a little bit more style on the hair. Because I do need to get myself a job. Okay, and then, oh, right, the frost resistance. That is also done. That is good. We get six of those. Hmm, that's some. Um, I mean, we only need to find a little bit of uh, silver. And after we find silver, we will be able to... Um, go directly to the plains, I believe, and then after the plains it is Mistlands, and after Mistlands it is Ashlands. Have I forgotten about the biome now? Maybe. Okay, let's head off in this direction. I mean, also, I mean, even though it's a little bit cheating to be able to portal through with the uh, iron, uh, when I first started the game, I just thought to myself, well, why can't I just get all of the iron in my inventory, switch world to another world, put that in a chest, and then, you know, go to the other world, go back home to the forging area, and switch and then the bait and switch and just teleport that way. I mean, that's what I did the first time. It was a lot easier. Anytime I see a flat area, I immediately think planes. Oh, where's the wife? There you go. You're just jumping around with the deals. Come on, wife. I don't have all day. Let's see if we can save her and like a row. Oh, oh sneaky snack. Let's see, one thing, ah, uh, maybe, uh, wife, 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 create a fire. That's not a fire, <laughs> a campfire. <laughs> oh, that's going in the video. <laughs> it's adorable. Yes, create a fire. Just holds up a torch, fire. <laughs> uh, timber. I mean, by the time she has made a fire, uh, we are already dry, but it doesn't matter was worth it for <laughs> for the clip. Oh, there we go. Yeah, and then we're dry. Good job, wife. <laughs> now we can continue. <laughs> uh, okay, this is the way. Now, I, yeah, I still have my boat with me, so I could sail over there. Maybe that's 
something that we should do. But is that planes? Or is that, hmm, that could be something. Let's see, I have a little bit of arrows with me too. Yeah, I mean, we do need to go out. Oh, you bastard, eh? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's right, I can't attack downwards with this thing. Now, I did create a spear, since we did gather a shit ton of iron. Um, but I, oh, it's also night. Uh, that's not good. I wonder, uh, by foot or by boat? Well, might as well just put this down and might as well put down a portal and then we can head home and then we can sleep because I don't want to uh, ride around in a boat in the dark. Let's see. Ah, then again, the wind is with us and if we sleep, um, we will see. We will see. Why do I on? Oh, maybe I'm too far away. Let's see. Come on, wife. Come on. Here we go. Dream you're walking in snowy wood. Well, we're heading up to the, towards the mountains. They make some more frost potions. That could come in handy. Okay, now we do need to find also Leviathan. At least I think we do. Let's see. Uh, which way? Oh, this boat is huge. Let's see. Okay, the wind is still on our side. So I guess we're gonna go a little bit this way. Maybe dip our foot into that area. Okay, then we have a portal, then we have this, and now we can sail. Yeah, because this ship has a large container, and then you could just fill that up with all the iron and stuff that you need. And we've done that many times before, but again, we're just moving it along a little bit faster. I do believe that I can just ram a uh, steel serpent, right? I don't think there's any problem with just doing that. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's more. There's more, 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 more. What you might call it? Swamp over there. Ah, huh, not bad. Looks like it's a big swamp too. Oh, hang on. Speaking of Leviathan. Apparently these are supposedly rare. But I don't really think they are. Okay, wife, get ready to jump off. Because once we jump off the both of us, the boat should stop. It's dead fast. Okay. We need some of those barnacles, at least to make a harpoon. And jumper. There we go. Got a little bit wet, but that's fine. Okay, let's get all of these... Uh, abyssal barnacles that we can. There we go, abyssal razor and harpoon. I don't remember how much we need it, but we need at least one harpoon in order to... Ah, uh, what else sinks? Then again, if we kill the sea serpent closer to the shallow waters, I mean, it shouldn't be that much of an issue. Let's see, is he sinking? Ah, uh, okay, not yet, not yet. Careful with the stamina, wife, because once he starts sinking and we got in and get into the water, if we don't have stamina, we drown. I'm speaking of experience. Okay, maybe something is happening. I should put on my headset in order to hear. Okay, I think that... Oh, there we go. Okay, get get some stamina. I think stuff is happening right now. Run and jump. Swim level 5. Yes. Aha! Not bad. Okay, we got quite a few. Not bad. And the uh, winds have changed. That's not the best, but... I mean, we are also going this way. Oh, that's planes. Oh, so it was a planes biome. Right, let's see, we do need to go a little bit this way. Okay, so Plains is over there. I mean, that looks like it's on the same continent as the Elder. Hmm. I mean, we, we will see. Right now, we kind of just want to take care of bone mass. And then perhaps we can start getting up to and towards the mountain. Uh, uh, is there a storm coming? That might be good. Because I do believe that the sea serpents spawn more if there's a storm about. And if you time it correctly, you should be able to get pretty much everything from a sea serpent if you kill it in the middle of the ocean. Uh, we will see. Okay, so we're going this way. Soon we just need to go straight. Hopefully the wind changes by then. Maybe. Okay, no sea serpents yet. It's good. That's a black forest, eh? Well, the wind is going in the exact opposite direction as it should be. At least that is going to be easier once we kill Motor. Mother and the uh, Dragon Balls. Because then we can just pick and choose whether... Well, the wind direction ourselves. And since we're two people, we can almost have it indefinitely. <laughs> if you're three, you can. Okay, come on, wind. I need you to change direction. We're gonna go a little bit more this way. Just to have a tiny little bit. At least that's what's good about big ship. That you're able to pretty much go in any direction, even though this is even though the wind goes the other way. But yeah, we we will see. Now, we have managed also to buy pretty much everything we needed uh, from the trader, since there's a lot of treasures in those sunken crypts. We might as well crash into whatever we're heading towards now. Okay, time for a little bit of shopping action. Uh, let's see, yeah, let's use a little bit like so. 
hopefully it's not getting too deep. There we go. Uh, let's see, nothing sunk to the bottom, I believe. Hang on, yes it did. Where's the nails? Nails? Where did the nails go? Are those the nails? That's the nails, okay, yeah. But that should be fine. Hang on. Wife, give me wood. <laughs> give me wood, wife. Wife wood. Go. It's wood. Okay, let's see. Where did the... Let's see. Where's the nails? Are they over there? Yeah, and then we just jump and... Push. Oh, so close. Maybe higher. Okay, gonna try again. Up and... Ah, oh, so close. I mean, we have plenty of iron at home already, so it's not the biggest issue. I might need more wood, wife. Oh, there we go. All ah, right, because I'm carrying too much. Oh, that's why I couldn't pick it up. Okay, okay. Stuff makes sense. Uh, let's see. And a portal. And go through the portal. Let's see. Yeah, I do need one of these for probably traveling. Let's see. What was it? Uh, it was probably 30, 10, 40, 100. Yeah, that's it. Neato. Let's see. A missile racer. We don't really need that. But we do need missile harpoon. Ah, uh, 30. 8 and 3. There we have the Abyssal Harpoon. Not too shabby. Now, they did nerf this thing. Uh, I know that you can slingshot your friends. In this case, my wife, like, across the map with this thing. I mean, I'm not sure if it still works. But yeah, uh, at least before you could use it on any boss. And that's how I kind of exploited the Agloth. Because I just dug a hole, harpooned the bastard, and then dra drug him. And then I dragged him down the hole and just you know, started attacking. Easy as pie. But at least these are good for the serpents. Uh, this might be the way to go. Okay, so I've left my wife behind since she is currently eating. So we will see. Cat is sleeping and our daughter is at her grandmother's house. So we have some time to play. After cleaning the entire apartment. Yeesh. Now, when it comes to the dragon eggs, I'm not really sure if we should do the same tactic of, well, basically cheating. Instead of having to go back and forth. But uh, we, we will see how much time we plan on doing this, because there has been a uh, teaser trailer for the update of Enshrouded, and I really want to uh, make my wife play Enshrouded. That would be very fun, and I think she would enjoy it. Maybe. She's haven't really watched me play that much, but, I mean, it's a lot easier to get into than Valheim, I think. Even though she does love Valheim, so I am uh, guilty. And I have already bought it for her when it was on sale because, well, I was testing out uh, having a camera account, so... Yeah, but you need to make a server and stuff like that. But we will see. All we need is time. That's a big-ass mountain. Yeah, okay, okay. And it also looks like Bone Mass is on the same continent. So that's good. So we're gonna place a portal here anyways. Because we do enjoy killing the bosses twice just to have every th uh, trophy. Every world that we've created, we do have a trophy wall. Oh, hang on a minute. What do we have here then? Oh, that looks like a zombie village if I ever saw one. Uh, it's not the tallest mountain, but it is something. Uh, but yeah, let's uh, let's have a look see over here. I don't remember if there's anything good about having a zombie village. Would get more hot dogs, and hot dogs are fairly good. Early game food, at least. Ow. What hit me? A bastard. This is a zombie village, all right. Or a drogger village. Oh, well, hello, hello, hello. Come on, attack me. There we go. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. I wonder if these drogger are weaker than the ones are. Hang on, hang on. I can get a closer look at this bastard. Can I hit him? There we go. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Eh, okay. Eh, come on. No, nothing up here. Oh, okay. Oh, don't fall down. Fall damage is bad, okay. Uh, maybe. Oh yeah, hang on, when it comes to fall damage, I do believe, maybe, maybe just maybe, that if you have over 100 HP, you don't die from fall damage. And it's maybe still a thing. Need to test that out uh, later. Okay, anything in here? Loads of bastards. Yeah, but I don't think, I know, yeah, that's a beehive. Uh, bastard, come on. Attack man already. Come on, come on. There we go. I, I, I do need a torch, maybe. Oh, I do have the Dwarger Circle. Oh, hang on. I did not notice this. This is a big as plains biome. A very big plains biome. Very big. Oh, and a village. Nice. Yeah, that's gonna... Village and... Hang on. Okay, so bone mass is over there. There's also more uh, things over there. We do need to farm a lot of uh, mosquitoes because I do enjoy having those arrows. But yeah, let's uh, mark this place approximately here. Let's see, Goblin Camp. Uh, it looks like it's a fairly small one, but at least that's a good place to get flax and 
Barley? Flax and barley. Yeah. Uh, okay, something is tearing down that tower. Yeah, and also another great way to get stones, since we can make stone buildings right now, is just, you know, to dig out the bottom of those pillars, and then once you dig out everything, the entire thing falls down. Okay, so this is probably a very good continent. Loads of swamps and plains and uh, also a big mountain. Okay, looks like she's having fun. Oh, hang on. What happens if... Let's see, if I put down a crafting station and then I repair this thing and then I dismantle this thing, do I get... Oh, you do get iron nails from that. Hmm, interesting. Okay, now I'm starting to think about speedrunning tactics, but and that's not something that we we're gonna do. I think, like, the current world record of every boss is, like, what, five hours? Six, eight hours? That's a, that's a speedrun and a half. Okay, but bonus should be right over Mirror. And I do believe we have everything we need in order to defeat him. So, we will see. We will see. And, I mean, after we defeat him, now I'm just... Assuming that we were able to do it on the first go, then we could probably try to test out those mountains up there. Okay, I'll stay a little bit away from the plains. Even though we have better armor now, I think we need a lot better food. Speaking of food, yeah, I don't enjoy how fast everything goes down. Let's see, eat that instead. There we go, a little bit more health. Oh, that's another one of these bastards. Oh, might as well. And a swoosh. Oh, Jesus, everything at once. Oh, God. Okay, okay. Slow and steady. Oh, good way to level up. Oh, hang on. That's a blob. Yeah, that's not something that we want to mess with. Let's see. Okay, attack his legs. He's uh, focused on the wife. That's good. Okay, let's do a big attack. And there we go. And another one. Nice. Yeah, these abominations are <laughs> a lot easier than you would think. Come on. Grab down. Yes. And should probably mark some more of the uh, sunken crypts. Just because once we get into... Oh, hang on, that's poison. Once we get into the plains and we get some flax, we can make another one of these, really? Okay, I think that I'm just gonna run away. Yeah, once we get into plains, get some uh, flax, we can make it into linen. And then we can make the padded armor. Okay, yeah, there we have it. Nice. Oh, I didn't see any crits on the way. Okay, that's it. But stuff is looking good right here. I mean, might as well get some more stamina. Then make a little bit of a hole maybe here. Yeah, one thing that always comes in handy. Uh, well, that was my wife. I'm gonna keep that in the video. She just screams out sometimes. Scares the living shit out of me. But yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, it is good practice to... Oh, hang on, Draugr. Yeah, I'm making loads of noise, see? Here we go, yeah. Uh, to get rid of all of the water around, just to flatten stuff out, so that we don't get attacked by leeches and such. Now, I do see some, well, not bonfires, what are they called? Gazers? Uh, I like, there we go, leeches. I mean, not the worst thing in the world, because once we fight this guy, we will be using uh, resistance, uh, poison resistance. But it is still good to be able to run around a little bit and not get slowed down by the water. So yeah, a tiny little bit of preparation always comes in handy. Ah, uh, I truly wish that <laughs> this wasn't reliant on stamina. Uh, well, it is what it is. Okay, this should maybe, maybe be a good area. Okay, let's head home. Uh, let's see, one thing that I probably need, I'm just gonna assume that bone mass is still susceptible to blunt damage, so... We're gonna take my wife's mace. We are gonna kill Bone Mace. Right here, right now. Well, not right here, but then... Let's see. What do we have there? Ah, more frost resistance. Perfect. That's something that we're gonna need. Put that back over mirror. Okay, 12 of those. That's good. Let's see. And we do need... Where have I put that thing? Yeah, we need 10 of the withered bow. Right over. Just keep an eye on that. We have the club. We have the shield. What does this say anything? Cook their remains. Yep, that is the bones. Wife, are you ready? Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Okay, po poison resistance. I have already consumed that. He should spawn right here. Where is he? There he is. Okay, start doing damage. Ooh, yes. Come on, buddy boy. He is puking. That is fine. Should not do too much damage. Ow! Okay, yeah, he still hurts. What is he doing? Yeah, he's throwing those little bastards. 
There we go. And whoosh. Okay, get some more stamina. Ow. Okay, yeah, it does hurt still. Okay, not bad. He's puking again. Shouldn't be a problem. Oh, okay. Well, I am healing a little bit. I can't see anything, but that should be fine. Ow. Okay, make sure to make the uh, hits count. Okay, come on, just attack away. Ow, okay, I need to run a little bit. Let's get some action here. I mean, ah, the bows do a tiny bit of damage. Okay, my wife also needs to be careful now. Maybe some rolling action. Yeah, that should do the trick. Okay, it's hard to see. Oh, wife, careful wife. Use a healing potion. Ow, well, I should take my own advice then. Okay, let's get rid of these blobs. Okay, roll over. Okay, I'm... Let's see, can I eat more? Yes, yes I can. Okay, I mean only 20 more seconds and I should be able to do something. I mean, he might one-shot me right here, but no, I am too fast for him. Come on, you bastard. And a big swing to the butt. Okay, he's gonna puke again, that is fine. Come on, hit this bastard. And there you go. Ha 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 ha. Easy as pie. Well, we almost died. We're geared to the teeth. We have the poison resistance. But yes, okay, so now we're gonna place this over mirror. That's to our wife. No, let's see. What has Hugging left to say? Bomb has left a parting gift. Yeah, silver reigns from this thing. Okay, and then one to the wife. Okay, not bad. 